Well, hello again. Welcome to another Lockdown Electronics video with me, Bill. And this video is going to be very, very short indeed, but just want to um, show you a bit of a modification I've made to a piece of equipment that I've bought. And the piece of equipment in question is this, which is one of those um, cheap Chinese um, component testers. Um, this one was about £15 off eBay and uh, it has a built-in battery it has this uh, zero insertion for socket on the front you press the button and it uh, tests um, a component with up to up to three uh, legs or three attachment points so transistor whatever and it tells you what it is it'll do resistance capacitance inductance does semiconductors and for 15 pounds actually um, I'm pretty impressed um, it's actually pretty good don't know how long it'll last but it was 15 quid so if there's one thing that is a pain in the neck it's these plugs because they're not terribly strong and it's also extremely easy to first of all remove them from the cable a bit like has happened there and yeah you can solder them back on but they're not they're not particularly robust plugs and the other thing it's very easy to do if you're not careful is to pull out uh, one of the plugs when you're moving it about so I decided I need to do something about that so uh, what I've done appears to have worked quite well most of the component testing I do um, involves um, components with two connections resistors capacitors inductors etc so I've not lost any functionality I can still use the zip socket can still use the three plugs if I need to but I had a look inside the case and there was a reasonable amount of room so I've been able to fit a couple of banana plug sockets, the standard size banana plug sockets. I had to be a bit precise about how I drilled the locations for those two sockets but I've wired them um, to pins one and three on the circuit board and it allows me to use a pair of standard size um, banana plug probes of any any description really these these I've got with the bulldog clips on and it's com for me completely transformed the, the usability of the uh, of the tool um, not difficult at all to, to use it now those are nice and robust they don't pull off and uh, it's working quite well and as I say if I need to check something with three connections I can still do that um, just unplug those and use it in the original fashion so that was quite a useful modification that for me and something um, you might consider uh, these banana plug sockets are very cheap and you can use a standard set of, um, of probes um, so there you go